I used to take myself out on dates. Open my own damn doors, pay for everything on my plate. Sometimes I'd even get the steak. Cause I got it like that. I always have my own bag, never needed no man. Welcome back, welcome back to another bomb ass video. If you're new here, you are looking at the one and only Mayor Nisha. And in today's video, we are about to do a slay. Slay. You guys, so your girl has been tripping, slipping on the vlog. So I was like, let me do a little makeup video in between this Vlogtober. Okay, so today is Vlogtober, not a Vlogtober. Okay, so I'm not really trying to do like anything special to be honest. Like to be to be completely honest, we just trying to do a look. We just trying to do a uh, a. Uh, I don't know. I guess it's kind of maybe like be a chit chat slash like ranting sl session and just to get a video out to be honest so that I can stay on task. <laughs> so I'm just going to go in with my nude palette by Huda Beauty. Y'all I never even put it in the description from the last on the last products on my video and I'm like oh it's going to be in the description. You guys, like, this is, like, the most tedious thing ever is, like, filling in the description box. Like, why did I set myself up talking about I'm going to do it? I know I don't be wanting to do it. <laughs> but I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it probably tonight when I edit this video. But, you guys, your girl has been out here really out here i am definitely trying to be a serial entrepreneur at this point like i don't got one business to like kind of like i see the light and at this point i'm like you know what i can do it i can do anything now and then i'm gonna just use Y'all know I like glitter, so I'ma just go with my favorite glitter shade and put that in the middle. So I am working on my next business adventure already, which I'm so so very excited about. I'm not gonna share it with you guys yet because I want to take you guys like behind the scenes, and I want to take you up into the point of like my first success story i don't know it's not called a success story i can't think of anything else to say right now except for my first success story or my first because if i say anything else you guys would get it so yeah but i'm definitely on my next business adventure and i'm so 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 very excited about that and yeah And then I'm going to just use my NYX to do my liner. Okay, you guys. So, that is done. Y'all. So, I haven't really been vlogging, like, over the last couple days because my face broke out in the last video. So, yeah. In the last video, I talked about how I shaved my face and my face completely freaking broke out, you guys. And... It's just horrible. I haven't really wanted to vlog and I'm not doing anything. So it's like, what am I vlogging? Like, what am I doing? I'm not doing anything. And yeah, so now I'm behind. I was like ahead on content, but now I'm like super behind, which is fine. I mean, we'll get back on task, right? We can just put in a few content videos and be on our merry freaking way. And y'all, I'm like, this is like, being an entrepreneur is like, uh, like uh, always, you always have to be thinking, always have to be marketing. Like, my face completely broke out. Like, I had pimples all right here pimples right here i still have some right here i might i might have a video like because i was gonna start filming the progress of my skin and me using my products to heal my face and i just wasn't consistent enough 
so if I have it I'll insert footage here if not then I'm sorry but this is like a prime example of like a blonde moment so obviously I just told you guys my face broke out right so um I waxed my face and then my skin completely broke out like Ugh, just so annoying but y'all that was the perfect timing to really record myself and using femme official products to show how my products really work to heal your skin and I failed <laughs> like I completely failed like my skin looks so much better today and I've been using my stuff to fix my face why wouldn't you record that sis i don't know because i don't think you guys like i'm still like you know not a hundred percent like business minded it'd be so much stuff when i'll go back and like rewatch the video and it's like i'm not like a queen at marketing i'm not a marketing machine like that is my biggest struggle it's marketing marketing myself marketing my product and you know when you know you have good shit and you still don't market it like girl i don't know what to tell you <laughs> i genuinely don't know what to tell you y'all so i see ashley devana she always used like this full body sponge on her channel and I went to Target yesterday and they had this big ass beauty blender. So I was like, let me get it because I mean, for her, it just seems like it's like, it's so helpful. But y'all, this is ridiculous. <laughs> this is ridiculous. It's so big. And it's so, um, like, it's not soft like it's not as soft as like the yellow the orange one but okay i think it might work i think but anyway yeah i just can't believe i like completely forgot wasn't even thinking about it like mm -mm. but yeah i'm definitely i'm trying to like after like vlogtober i'm definitely thinking of different ways like how i want to vlog and just really trying to be consistent in the style and the way i want to vlog and edit my videos but that's a job in itself girl a job in itself So you guys, I've been really, really excited about my birthday collection that I'm trying to drop. Like my birthday is in January. I don't know if you know, if you knew here, but if you knew here, girl, get with it. January 25th is the biggest holiday of the year. Like that's the only time you really, really need to be saving your coin, girl, for January 25th, okay? Mark it on your calendar, honey. I know we only in October, but you need to mark January 25th on your calendar, sis, okay? Because that is the biggest holiday of the year. But anyway, so along with me trying to, you know, get to Black Friday together, which I think I'm pretty good on Black Friday. I already know what deals I'm going to do. I'm not trying to do, like, no special collections or anything. I'm just doing a Black Friday sale. But... I'm like really really focused on my birthday because I want to do a birthday drop and last year I had literally just opened my business and it didn't make sense for me to do like anything birthday related because I'm like I was still learning how to market I was still learning a lot of stuff so I wasn't like ready but this year you girl ain't playing no games we're having a birthday collection we're having a birthday drop so i've been trying to get that collection all the way together y'all 
But these vendors, they're trying me. Like legit trying me. So this one lady, cause I'm testing out different stuff to see what I like, to see like, if this is gonna be a part of my collection, is it gonna be like, one of the vendors, they already had good reviews. And silly me, I based my decision on purchasing through this company based on the reviews that they had, how many orders they already had. I just did kind of like a bulk order and I was like, this is it, honey. Well, they sent me the wrong stuff. Like, it's not right. And I spent $300 on this particular item and I can't sell it. <laughs> I mean, I could sell it, but it's just not what I was looking for for my collection. Cause I mean, it's sellable. It's nothing wrong with it. It's just not what I wanted. How about that? Cause it's definitely like a sellable, sellable item. It's just not what I was looking for. And when I reached out to the vendor to tell them that they sent me the wrong thing, she tells me that they can send me the correct item when I purchase again. Again? No. There's no purchase again. Like, I don't even... No, you messed up my... You messing up my whole collection. You're messing up my whole... You're messing up my whole flow. What do you mean again? I need my, my right product today, right now. So I sent her a message like, can you just send me the right product? And then I even sent her pictures and stuff so she know it's the wrong product. And I said, can you send me my right product and I'll just pay for shipping again. Now, if y'all know, like shipping in China is like, could be anywhere between 70 to $100. So even the fact that I'm willing to pay shipping again is crazy. I shouldn't be paying nothing because y'all should have sent me the right stuff. But... I'm like, I'll be willing to pay shipping just so I can get my right products because it's something that I really, really want to probably, you know, it's something I really want to add to my birthday collection. And this hoe has not responded at all. And like, they're supposed to be on like a holiday anyway. So she, I don't even know why she responded to begin with. But considering she did respond, I'm like, lady, are you just going to continue to leave me unread? <laughs> because I need my stuff. Now granted, you know, it's only October, my birthday is in January, so I have time. But nonetheless, like, ain't nobody got time for this. No, no, no. So, one of them, one of the products I was smart enough to just test out, I just bought a few before I just did a bulk order. And I actually like that one. It's, I mean, it's okay, but I like it. So I'm like, I should have done that. But y'all know, again, like I said, it's expensive to just spend a lot of money to ship and you're only getting like one item just to test it out. Like they be overcharging. So I try to go with companies who have reviews, but I realize like you really cannot even trust the re reviews. Like, or you can trust the reviews, but everybody like what you think is good quality everybody's standard is not the same like on one of the items like the quality is it's okay it's not bad quality but it's just not again what i was looking for but in the reviews it talked about how amazing the quality of this product is and i'm like did we get the same product because what i got is not that but this is when i be having to have talks with myself like darnisha because i know i'm very picky like i am a very very picky person i'm like i like things a particular way and when it's not up to par like i always got something to say but some things you know i kind of just settle I, I settle with a lot because i am just like i said i'm very very picky i'm very particular on like certain things so i'm like i don't know if it's just the pickiness in me that's just coming out or it's just like it's just not up to par so I don't know you guys like I don't know but I'm hoping we get it together 
I am so hoping we get it together, bro. Along with getting this office together, like I changed the background as you guys can see. And I'm not a super fan, so I'm thinking I'm gonna just do my green screen right here and I'll just put up, you know, something that I like. And then the one last thing I want to talk about before I end this video, guys, is P.O. Box unboxing. Um, I've gotten some messages in regards to P.O. Box unboxing and like doing small business promo or whatever. So if you guys have not watched any of my other videos, I will link them here. Make sure you check those out. But I am definitely not a believer in small business promos. Um, I don't genuinely think they work, to be honest, unless you have a huge following. I'm not somebody who have a huge following. So I don't want to have you guys send me things and nobody goes to support because I don't feel like I'm in the place where I have enough influence to bring people to go support you. The the things that I do show on my channel is because I supported those businesses. I use my own money and purchase from them com those companies and I put them on my channel because it's a part of my life, it's what I'm doing. And again, I spent my money on it. I support people who genuinely support me. Like if you support me by watching my videos, leaving comments, like I am definitely going to be here to support your business and I don't mind spending my money on your company. Like that's just that. But I mean, not saying that I only want to support people who my, I only want to support people who support me cuz if you ain't supporting me sis then what the fuck. But <laughs> Um, yeah, I just don't think I'm in a place where I can offer that service to do PO unboxings on my channel. Like, I don't, I'm, I don't get enough views. I, if I want to do an unboxing, like I said before in previous videos, I want to be able to do it right. I only want to, you know, have, I don't want to have a ton of products being thrown at me because I genuinely don't think that method works and I don't have a method that does work so I don't want to have you waste your heart girl we work hard for our, our products and I don't want to have you send those to me for me to put on my channel and not even get the buzz and you get nothing in return like I genuinely want you to see a return on your free promo like at least one sale I mean, if y'all want to send me stuff, like after all of what I just said, then my P.O. box will be in the description and I will put it on my channel. But I genuinely don't believe in it and I don't really want to do anything that I don't believe in and I just don't think I have an audience for it. So, I personally don't see the, see the point in it. But girl, if you just, just, if you feel it deep in your heart and you just want to send me something, go ahead girl. Send it in the description, but... <laughs> The P.O. Box, I'll link it, girl. I'll link it. But y'all, I'm going to just literally put some lip gloss on my lips and call this look a... a it's it, girl. It's it. I just kind of wanted to just come on here, talk with y'all, and give y'all some content, a video, because <laughs> she ain't got nothing. <laughs> she ain't got no vloggy vlog for tomorrow. Now I can go somewhere, and I can still probably finesse a vlog, but now I kind of want to leave it for the next day. You feel me? So... We are using our, this was Miss Independent, but she is gone, honey. She gone. Now we got a big old glitter. Can I see her? So we're going to go in with our Morphe spray. We're gonna spray our face with our fan, our bougie fan. Ooh. Ooh, woo. And we're gonna end this video right here, you guys. Hopefully, you enjoy this video. Just chatting it up with your girl. Hit subscribe, girl. Hit subscribe. And I will see y'all tomorrow. Peace out.